जेड ओ सी मीन्स ओपन सर्किटेड इंपीडेंस विल बी लिमिट जेड एल टेन्स टू इनफिनिटी जेड इन उल बी जेड जिरो बै जे टेन बीटा एल ऑलसो इट कम्स फ्रम इक्वेशन नम्बर इलेवेन ओके नेक्स्ट दैट मीस इट उल बी इक्वल टू जेड जिरो माइनस जे कॉट बीटा ए एंड दैट इज इक्वेशन नंबर एटीन now from equation number 13 and uh, equation number 15 15 means a is equal to 1 plus capital mod of capital gamma l by 1 minus uh, mod of capital gamma l now from equation number 13 and equation number 15 we can write that capital gamma l equal to one and s equal to infinite from equation number 13 and equation number 15 for the open circuited line we can uh, right that capital gamma l means reflection coefficient will be 1 and vhwr means a will be infinite now if we multiply and uh, this will be equation number 19 now if we we'll, uh, we multiply equation number 16 and equation number 18 then means z ac into z oc what will be the value of z ac into z oc z ac means J Z zero tan beta L and Z O C is minus J Z zero cot beta L. Means multiplication of Z S C O and Z O C will be equal to Z zero square. Now for the third condition third cases means if z l equal to z zero that is if the line is matched then what will be the value of impedance and what will be the value of reflection coefficient and is w r standing wave ratio now from equation number 11 we can write that impedance will be z in equal to z 
for this case z in equal to z zero and the equation number is that equation was 20 and that is equation number 21 now from equation number 13 and 15 you can write that reflection coefficient capital gamma l will be equal to 0 and standing wave ratio s will be equal to 1 and this is equation number 22 means for the three cases first case was shorted line if the transmission line is shorted line then um, impedance will be that is z sc equal to j z0 tan beta l and reflection coefficient will be minus 1 and uh, standing wave ratio will be infinite and for the second case that if the uh, transmission line is open circuited then means zl will be equal to infinite then the impedance will be minus g z0 cot beta l and reflection coefficient will be 1 and standing wave ratio is infinite now for the third case if the transmission line is mass then means j del equal to z0 then impedance will be z0 means characteristic impedance and um, reflection coefficient is 0 and standing wave ratio is 1.